Welcome back to this war of mine. So we're at the start of day 14 and we need to get to go in on a lot of things. We need food, we need to make water. Let's go make a sponge. Oh god. Pavel's very tired. Alright, you need to go to sleep, dude. Holy shit. Whoa, my people are messed up. Everybody's like a zombie. No one's even willing to run. Ah, uh, Bruno can run. Alright, everybody else needs to sleep if they could. We don't have enough beds. Alright, yeah, we need to make food right now. Which means we need to make water. Which means we need to make a filter. Bruno, you're gonna have to suck it up for everybody. Come on, man. Yeah, so everybody's just gonna <laughs> try to sleep. Uh, Amelia. Amelia, why are you sleeping? What the hell? You're not even tired. Get out of bed. Alright, we need... It's, oh, it needs... Oh, I thought it took two water to make food. It actually requires three. Shit. Alright, what can you do? Why don't you... Oh, we have more food. Oh, wait, actually... Eh, I think I'm gonna leave it there. No, I shouldn't. Fuck. Um, by the way, I know we can eat raw food, it's just not as nutritious, so I'm, I'm actually probably gonna have to do that today. There's no way I'm gonna have enough water. Alright, um, before you seed it again or whatever, let's make the herbal garden, because I think that's gonna require fertilizer to upgrade it most likely. Alright, so we can finally make an herbal garden. It's very expensive. But we can finally do it. Let's do it. It's been a long time coming. Where shall we put it? Yeah, let's put it over here. Yeah, put the herbal garden next to where all the, the rodents are. Perfect. Who are you? Need help. Yeah, you don't look like the traitor. Okay, well, Amelia is a talented lawyer, so she'll help you with your case. I'm sure you want to sue these people for endangerment. Endangerment? What? Endangering? I don't know. Is that even a thing? Endangerment. Yes, please step right this way, sir. I'll see your case immediately. Hello? Alright, hold on. Alright, so let's see how this thing works. Hmm. You can make fertilizer from food. Okay. Make fertilizer from food. You can convert food and fertilizer both into more food using the traps. Convert vegetables into fertilizer. And convert water and fertilizer into herbs. Alright, that's the herb garden part. Okay. So let's see what it takes to upgrade it. Holy shit, that's a lot of stuff. Holy shit. Okay. Lots of components. Wood. And a heat lamp. How do I... Oh, God. I probably need to upgrade one of my stations to a higher thing to get a heat lamp. Holy shit. Well, that was a waste. Unless I really, really, really want to make... Herbs. Which I really don't want to make fucking herbs, because I use the... I, I need the water to make food, and I need the fertilizer to get food. That was a massive fucking waste. God damn it. Alright, what? Got some interesting news. And good day to you. I live down the street, and I noticed you're living in this abandoned building. I've got some news. There was a humanitarian aid drop last night. Most containers were confiscated by the rebels, but I know about one they missed. It landed in no man's land, so it might be dangerous to get to it, but under the cover of darkness, we should be able to make it. I'll show you where it is if you help me carry the supplies. Deal? Uh... This sounds shady. So you want me to come with you into the night, into no man's land?
Um... Yeah. Uh... No. Yeah, I'm sure I can't help you. Goodbye. That's way too dangerous. I don't know what I'm gonna find there. I don't have any ammo left for my weapon, I believe. Yeah, I have no ammo left for it. Uh, no. I'm not... I'm not that desperate. That's a huge risk to take, and I'm not gonna take it. Yeah, unless I absolutely need it, and I don't. Alright, see this thing with fertilizer. Ooh, water's almost done, so we gotta go make another sponge. Let's go do that right now. I gotta keep making lots and lots of water. Yeah, we need to make food. Desperately. Desperately need to make food. Which is what I'm gonna get everybody doing, or well, rather get Bruno doing, right about now. Alright, let's check the radio, see if there's anything new. Do -do. Same weather. Classical music. Same coffee thing. Armed bands. Okay. God, Bruno, you have like a list of ailments a mile long. The most important is food. I've got, like, no wood left. God damn it, this thing was such a waste. Can I sell it? <laughs> Anybody want to buy my herbal garden? Alright, we're gonna have to eat the rest of it raw. S wow, she's listed as still very hungry. God damn it. Okay, eat again. Slightly wounded, slightly sick. You should be able to recover by sleeping. Jesus, wow, people are doing really bad. Pavel, you gotta wake up and go eat, man. Bruno, you gotta get to sleep. She's just hungry, so she's doing fine. Katya, you need to go eat. Oh, she won't even run. She's not even going to make it to the food in time. No, hold on. Don't. Oh, you ate it. No, you didn't. Good. You go up above. All right, Katya's going to eat this. I can't leave anybody very hungry. It's, pr it's probably what's making them all sick and stuff. It's probably just the hunger that's messing with them. Okay, now we're not too bad. Lots of sadness and tired, but nothing horrible. Except for Bruno, he's... Nothing horrible, but he's a lot of little bad things. Shit, somebody needs to get to sleep. Run to bed! You have ten minutes! Alright. Uh, a lot of people need to sleep. Bruno needs to sleep. Katya probably should sleep. Hell, if anybody shouldn't, like, if anybody should go scavenging, it should be Amelia, because she's not even tired, but her storage space is only 10. It's not good. We have nothing to trade, so it's not like it'd just be a trading run. Okay. <sighs> I don't have anything to trade, so the military outpost is bad. Church is also kind of bad. Don't have anything to trade. Most of the stuff left is just components. Which isn't bad, I guess, but... Yeah. Or, no, sorry, the hotel is where I, where, where I meant. I haven't been to the church. I think I might go to the... Yeah, I think I actually might go to the church. And bring a shovel. And just try to ignore the vestry, whatever the fuck that is. Hmm. Alright, I'm just gonna have Amelia guard. <sighs> I feel like I should have more guards, though, but these people, they really need to sleep. 
And I don't think I can go a night without scavenging. It's just not a good idea. Yeah, I'm gonna leave her to guard. Oh, I wish I had bullets. <laughs> yep. No sleep, she'll guard, he'll scavenge. Going to the church, I'm gonna bring the shovel. Could bring this in case I need it. Hmm. Nah. I wonder if just having a pistol, even if you don't have any ammo, is enough to intimidate them. Probably gonna get our food stolen. I almost want to take the food with me just so it doesn't get stolen. Ah, whatever. All right, we gotta look out for armed people. When I was a child, I would come here with my parents. So supposedly armed men in the vestry. Whatever that, what's, what's a vestry? We gotta be careful, gotta be very careful. We have to go up? Yeah, we gotta go up. Nice and easy. Anyone here? I don't see anyone. Vestry is probably over here on the. Oh shit! There is someone there, all the way over there. Okay. Uh... Is that a gun? That is a gun in their hands. All right. I hope they don't turn around. I'm getting scared. Keeping an eye on him. Okay, getting some pretty good stuff. Not a lot of stuff, but some pretty good stuff. I need more stuff, though. Anyone down here? No. Thing is, though, to get out, we're gonna have to go right up behind him. Up that ladder. Ooh, there's probably good stuff behind there. I need a saw blade, though. Ooh, coffee beans. Good trading item, because it's apparently gone up in price like crazy recently. But yes, if I could cut through that, there's probably really good stuff down there. Pure alcohol. More valuable than simple moonshine. You can drink it, you can trade it, or you can use it to produce meds or bandages. Nice. There's some really good stuff here. Okay, shit, he's coming. Shit. Hide, hide, hide. Oh. What is he doing? Am I being fault? No, no, of course you're not. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, there's good stuff behind here if I can break through it and bring a shovel. Alright, so I don't think there's anybody actually down here. Oh, get digging. Get digging. Gonna come back at some point. Well, probably gonna come back. Hopefully he stays over there. And I think digging makes a lot of noise, right? So you don't want to do it when you're next to somebody? Yeah, it does. Looks like it makes about the same noise as running. Oh, no, keep digging. If I go in here, I don't think I need to cut this, right? Because this leads to the same place. 
Yeah, nice. It's really good stuff in here. Sugar, don't really care. Herbs, eh, it's not really very good. Take the herbs over the sugar. Unless I want to dump something. Nah. Alright, I want to get myself a couple extra hours to leave, because I might need to sneak, so I think we need to leave, like, right about now. Hmm, <clears throat> gun parts are more important than herbs. It's more important than a lot of stuff. Certainly more important than one component. Fertilizer. Also pretty important for getting more food. What do I want to dump? Piece of wood? Alright. Alright, we're gonna go. Alright, so where is this guy? I think he's still gone. I don't see him. I think he's still gone. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Run to exit. Alright, yeah, that's pretty dangerous. But we're good. Alright, I'm guessing our shit was stolen. Because we only had Amelia, the lawyer, with no good weapon to uh, guard us. I see two sleeping people. Okay, Amelia's there, so nobody's dead. It's good. How are we raided? Of course. They stole everything that mattered. Thank you. None of us was wounded. Excellent. We should put more people on guard. Yeah, tell that to the people that were about to die of sickness. Well, okay, they weren't that bad, but... Anyway. Things we'd need desperately. Water. Go make sponges. Pavel, you need to go sleep. Katya, you're good. Amelia, you need to go sleep. Alright, <laughs> we're just running around like crazy. Ooh, we have some more food. Excellent. Need to go fast. We need to get this water going. I don't even know what the hell's happening anymore. Who's doing what? Katya, what, what am I having you doing? Apparently I had you go up here. All right, radio. Thanks for some humanitarian aid, aid drops. Coffee is once again available in Bogoran. Damn it, and I just got coffee. Mm. Bands of looters, extreme vigilance is advised. Wish I had ammo. Let's get some more water going. Bruno has collected this meat. Let's seed the trap. Bait the trap. Master bait the trap. Alright, do we have any water to cook with? We have literally no water. Wonderful. If we don't eat the food, it's gonna go to waste, so we gotta make the food with the water we have, which we need to make water twice if we want to make all the food, so... Yeah, fuck. Well, let's prepare and make two fuels, I guess. In the meantime, we have our useless, extremely expensive herb garden. <laughs> we just gotta hope somebody wants to trade. Because, uh, we do have the alcohol. Yeah, actually, that's where we need to go tonight. We need to go trade using the alcohol, because otherwise they're going to steal it and we're going to be screwed. Yeah. We gotta do that. It's easier to fall ill when it's so cold. I guess it is a little bit cold. Could I make a fireplace? I probably don't have the stuff for it anymore. Nope. I'm out of everything. Because the fucking herb garden, which I'll never upgrade. Okay. 
Can't make a damn thing. Well, can make a saw blade. Which, actually, I should, because... Yeah, I'm probably going to go back to the church, unless I'm going to go trade. If I go back to the church, then I should make the saw blade. Because I can get into that really good-looking room that looks like it had a million things to shovel up, but there's probably some really good stuff behind it. Five hours, five, six, seven, eight... Yeah, I don't think I'll have time to make two batches of water and cook the food, but I can at least cook one of the foods. So the question needs to be answered of whether I'm going to go trading tonight or go scavenging. I think I need to go trading. Yeah, I think I do. I gotta use up my stuff before it gets stolen. I don't have any good way to defend myself. Alright, we're going trading, so there's no need to make the saw. Let's wait for the water to finish, make some food. Uh, we're doing okay. Everybody's hungry, but nothing horrible. Should think about heating. Yeah, I really need heating. Oh, I don't have another sponge thing. Actually, you get making food. I'll get her on the sponge. Maximum efficiency. <laughs> now the question is who gets to eat? Because everybody is of equal hunger. You know what? Screw it. Bruno cooked it. He gets to eat. My story. I have a dearest friend who always worried a lot. One day she called me, terrified, saying there was a riot outside. The secessionists were inciting the crowd to burn the town hall. I told her not to worry. And I was right. Nothing came of it. This time. But even when the riots and fights began, uh, became everyday news, I kept assuring her it would all blow over soon. Somebody else has an updated bio. Nope. Okay, we still have one raw food, but yeah, we're not going to get to cook that right. That's uh, five hours total, I think. About four hours left. Four plus four, eight. No, we're not going to have time. Should we just eat the raw food? You know, I'll have them take it with them. They're going to go trading. They're not going to fill up their inventory. I'll just, yeah, whoever goes trading, which will be Amelia because she's good at it. Um, I'll just have them take the food. Yeah, that's something I can make. Is anybody tired at all? I don't think anybody's tired. No, nobody's tired. Alright. Get some last minute rest, Amelia, before you go out bartering, I guess. Go have a seat. Yes, that's it. Wait. Oh, never mind. Okay. There's nothing much to guard. And nobody... Well, nobody's tired, so... Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. We got a bunch of new places. Yeah, three new places. Okay. Construction site. <clears throat> it was supposed to be a luxurious residential area, and there was a great hype on apartments there, but the developers fled abroad when the war started. Recently, the military wrested control over this area from the rebels. We could scavenge whatever the rebels left behind, but there's a risk of encountering military patrols. Hmm, it's dangerous. Semi-detached house. Half of it is a ruin, but there are people living in the other half. Apparently. 
or a, wait, is that a comma or a period? I think it's a comma, I can't quite tell. Anyway, apparently they're in hostile and have a lot of stuff to barter, even food and meds. Let's remember to take something to trade if we're gonna pay them a visit. Hmm. It says danger, though. Wait, it says they aren't hostile. But then it says danger. Possible trade. Whereas hotel, which I've already traded at, only says caution. That's weird. It's inconsistent. Anyway, I might go trading there. Scout out a new place. Maybe there's some stuff to scavenge anyway. Warehouse. Used to be a warehouse of a big store. Currently it's used as a hideout by a group of armed thugs. Uh, we might find useful things there if we can sneak in, but it's very dangerous. Wait a minute, look at this. This one doesn't even list danger as one of the things. Okay, this, this list of stuff is really inaccurate. The place where it says you can trade, it says caution advised. Another place where it says they're not hostile, it says danger. And then a place where it explicitly says is very dangerous, doesn't even say it's dangerous. Right. Let's go to the semi-detached -de house and go trade. Yeah, so I'll have Amelia go, because she's a good negotiator. I guess I'll just have everybody else guard, right? I mean, they're not tired. Yeah. Okay. We definitely want to trade with this extremely valuable alcohol. Aside from that, coffee? Mm, if I keep it, it would make some of our people a bit happier. Maybe I should keep it. Oh yeah, and I was gonna take the food. Do I need to take the food if I have three people guarding? They don't have good weapons, though. I'll leave it with them. <laughs> Somehow we still have our medicine left. They've never stolen that. I don't think I need this much gunpowder. I'll sell some of it before it gets stolen. Same with some of these electric parts. Alright. Go trade with that. Okay, so they're not hostile. The destruction is unimaginable. It's a miracle the other half still stands. Yeah, so there's actually stuff to scavenge as well as trade. Excellent. Probably a person. Or... No, it's a rat. Okay. Should be somebody here. Oh. It's over there. Hello. In that case, I don't think I need to sneak around. Got something you'll like. It's locked. Shit. Should've brought a crowbar. Um... Wait, can I get her to go down this way? If so, how will she get out? I guess she probably just gets back up on the table. Yeah, nothing but rats in there, but there is a fridge, which means there's probably food in there. So if I bring a crowbar, then I can get some. Something written here. The crude letters on the wall reads Hannah Thomas or Tomas, I think. Hannah, Tomas, and me moved in with Uncle Radu. We buried Mom in the yard. Take care, Daddy. Petra. Damn, there's a lot of stuff here. What do I need more? Components or wood? Kinda need both pretty equally. There's a lot of stuff here. Alright, 
Alright, we should probably go trade. Yeah. Hello, Vanya. Let's see, what do you have? So canned food would mean I don't have to cook it, which is good. Uh, let's see. Really? You won't even give me two pieces of food for pure alcohol, you dick. You massive, massive penis. How much do you want for this shit? Okay, so let me see if canned food is worth more than raw food. So he'll, he'll just make the trade for two raw foods. Let's try two canned. Nope, it is worth more. But... If you can cook it with water, then... I think it's probably the same nutrition. Do I actually need food this bad? I don't know, I kinda want bullets. How much are bullets worth? It's quite common. Okay, apparently they're not worth that much. I would like two food, though. Oh. Yeah, you can get two bullets for really cheap, actually. Alright, yeah, I'm willing to part with that. A little bit of ammo and some food. Sure. Okay, got a bit more space. Yeah, this place is... Look at how much stuff is in there. If I... If I bring a crowbar, I can get into here and get to a fridge. If I bring a shovel, I can get into here and... Oh, I can actually steal the shopkeeper's stuff. Hmm. Yeah, there's a lot of safe loot to get here. Let's see if I can get a little bit more. Probably want something other than herbs. Or tobacco, rather. Yeah. Actually, I think I want wood. Yeah, let's see if I can find some more wood. Gotta say, for uh, Amelia being a lawyer, she's pretty good at jumping around and gathering up stuff over extremely dangerous and hazardous environments. Alright, that's good. Let's go. Wait, did I, I just realized I sent Amelia to go... Why did I send Amelia? I meant to send the person that was really good at negotiating. Amelia is not that person. It's Katya. What the fuck? Whoops. I just realized that. Okay, everybody's alive. Let me guess, we got raided. Oh, what a surprise! Hmm... None of us was wounded, and the attackers didn't steal anything. Okay. Excellent. Alright. Yeah, that was actually a really good night. Everybody's pretty damn hungry. Slightly sick and tired, so a lot of people need to sleep and stuff, but, uh... Yeah, that went pretty well. Got three foods. Should be able to cook up all of it, I think. Uh, maybe not. Actually, you probably won't be able to. Also, did somebody just make coffee? 
You did. Yeah, I think Katya just uh, brewed up the coffee. Or something. Brewed up something. Alright, well, I think I'm going to end this episode here. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.